Hey, good afternoon, everyone. Um, another edition of Mindful Moments from our team here um, on a series of conversations and advice we uh, often provide to individuals who are, you know, consider themselves to either be more introverted or they might be an ambivert. We've all heard of the probably term introvert and extrovert. Ambiverts are, are kind of in the middle. They could go either way. And the biggest thing that we see, that we observe, is when they're in the right frame of mind, the right mood, they've had a good day, they want to be social, they could be the life of the party. Uh, very outgoing, very engaging. And a ton of fun. When they're tired, when they've had a long week, uh, they need their downtime. And so they flex more as, or they show more as an introvert in that regard. And so the advice we often give is when you recognize that you're either in one of those moods, you've had a long day or a long week, you've been traveling a lot for work, uh, maybe not right now, uh, but you've been in meetings, you've just, you're on people overload, or you have a day where you know you need to get a lot done. Simple advice, simple fix, proactively let people know around you. So they're not wondering why. Because ambiverts can be social and outgoing. And so maybe your team, maybe people who have met you a couple times had that experience with you. And now they get the other side of that and they're wondering what they did wrong. They, they're wondering what the, how they may have upset you. And it's purely just because you're tired. You're, you're on people overload. So find a way to just politely and proactively let people know that you're in one of those modes or having one of those days, and it will remove a lot of the filling in of the blanks by other people.